Hey guys, it's Erica from Erica Marie Plans. Welcome back to my channel for another memory plan with me. This week I am doing the week of November 9th through the, oh dang, I just like, I didn't put the date dots down. November 15th. So <laughs> this was the week that we finally came home um, for Thanksgiving week-ish. We stayed for like two weeks, but this was the first week we finally came home, um, and this whole week kind of consisted of just prepping and packing, getting the house cleaned, and then doing our super long drive home. Um, I am using this kit from Glam Planner. This is her November mystery kit from 2019. Um, I know she just recently reformatted this kit, and it's it should be available on her shop. I know it came out maybe like three weeks ago. Um, so you can still get your hands on this, which is really nice. And I didn't even plan it out that way. Um, I did use a double box extender to put down this huge box, which I really wanted to use, but really didn't have the room to do it just because on, what day is that, Thursday? On Thursday, I really didn't have a lot to put down. So I put so many half boxes down just to take up space, but I mean, it looks okay. It's whatever. And then um, I'm just using some hollow foil. This kit did come with silver foil, but I really wanted to use hollow, so I did. And then I used some bougie boxes. These are just leftovers I've had from Scribble Prints Co. Um, I do have a tape roll from, I think it's Rose Color Days that I use for hollow, but I wanted to use this up first before opening that. So this is just what I had left over. And then I also used some day extenders. I used quite a bit of day extenders because there were so many boxes in this kit that I just wanted to use. And some of the days were like quite busy. So I needed to take advantage of those day extenders. Now I'm like super low on them. So I need to make a purchase to get some more. Um, that is pretty much it for this week. Oh, there is something really exciting that did happen that was kind of like really last minute. I wasn't really planning on doing this but it was just like spur of the moment I'm like you know what? I'm just gonna do it and we'll see what happens and then it ended up being a positive thing so you'll see that later on um I'm just gonna go ahead and get started because there are quite a few things that did happen this week so I'm just gonna finish my sidebar and then I'll move on to the day by day so first thing on Monday that I'm marking is that I bought all the stickers I don't remember what I bought. It may have just been my um, order from Kinsey's Creations. I think that's what it was. I can't remember. Um, and then, so I used a buy all the sticker script from Kinsey's Creations, which you can use my code um, Eric Marie Plans to save on your purchase. I will have all my codes linked down below for any shops that I do PR for. I just have codes for so you guys can check those out. And then I used a girl from Pumpkin Paper Co. to mark that. I also did a post office run. I had to drop off some kits that I was selling um, at the post office. And then the PO run is from Adorably Amy Designs and I used an icon from SPC. I also had to get some gas this day. Um, the Get Gas script is also from Adorably Amy Designs and an icon from SPC. Moving on into the later part of Monday, I used a Coffee Monsters Co. Coffee Monsters Co. No, I think it's Once More With Love sticker um, to mark that I went and got Starbucks. Um, I didn't have a Starbucks hollow script, so I used a coffee hollow script that I have from Magical Sticker Co., um, which is Lindsay from Lindsay Morgan Plans. It's her shop that she just opened, and so I did make a a purchase on her opening day so I use um, some of those stickers throughout the spread um, but that is where the coffee script is from I also had a super busy day at work um, the busy day script is from right brain paper co which is no longer open unfortunately and then I use another once more with love sticker um, to mark the busy day I also cooked some dinner I think I checked cooked chicken adobo adobu I can't I, I know I've said this before that I cannot say it um I don't know why but that's what I made for dinner the cook script is also from a right brain paper co and then that crock pot is from once more with love I also had to call tech support this day for my computer it was not working for work um and I was on the phone with them for like an hour so 
use an icon from SPC to mark that. And then I also FaceTimed my dad this day. The FaceTime script is from Letters to Apollo, which I have a coupon code for that will be linked down below. And I used a Coffee Monsters Co. emoji to mark that. Moving on into the later part of Monday, or the last part of Monday, um, I had some planning time. It was, I think I was just doing it in my A5 wide um, on my own. So this is before I started like filming. And then the planning time script is from Magical Sticker Co. as well. And then um, I used a Paper Shire planner. And then the last thing I marked with this super sparkly hollow box from SPC is that I watched the blacklist. Um, I finally got my custom scripts in from Kenzie's Creations with um, just all my customs. Um, so we've been really into the blacklist. We're still in season two. Um, I think we've only watched it one other time since coming home because we didn't watch it while we're back in California. But um, that's that. And then I used the TV sticker from Right Brain Paper Co. Moving on into Tuesday. So Tuesday I did film quite a bit this day. I wanted to have some videos pre-filmed for you guys and I mean still I, I really suck at editing and uploading videos so I still only had my normal amount of videos I usually would or probably less um, these past couple weeks so I apologize for that but the film script is from Kinsey's Creations and I use another pumpkin paper co-girl to mark that. Also loaded the dishes this day. Um, that is a glam planner girl. I think that is Lolly I want to say. And then I also did some kind of like meal prepping. I cooked some like chicken breast just because we had a whole bunch of it and I wanted to make sure it was used up before we left. Um, so I just cooked a whole bunch of chicken so that we can do like chicken salad, Caesar chicken salad. Um, I can't remember what else we made, but we did a couple things with it while we were here. And then this day I had a meeting um, and I missed my meeting and I was so upset because it's, I don't know, I like doing those meetings because it's literally an hour of not having to do anything because you just kind of hang out. And I got my time zones mixed up because it's just a whole mix up. It's so confusing here because my scheduled times are in PST, but I don't live in PST. Um, and my computer adjusts to PST, so my computer is not the actual time I live in. But on my emails, it does it it's like the actual time I live in. So I was an hour late and it was already over. I hope that probably did not make any sense. So anyway, I was just really mad because it was just an hour. I could have just relaxed for a bit. And then to end our night, I made some vegan cookie dough because we were both craving cookie dough. And so I just went downstairs and made a little batch of vegan cookie dough for us too. And we had that for dessert. And then moving on into Wednesday, first thing I wanna mark is that it was Veterans Day. Um, I used a script from uh, rose color days and then I also woke up pretty early this morning I used another pumpkin paper co girl to mark that I've been loving those girls and I really de need to do another um, purchase from her shop and then the wake up early script is from Kinsey's creations and then this day we miss the trash once again we missed it the week prior I think the last two weeks before this and it's just been building up I'm like okay we need to have the trash come or like get our trash out because it needs to be picked up before we leave and it always comes at 3 p.m. so we always put it out the, in the morning and for some reason it decided to come at 7 a.m. today or that day and I'm like what the heck so we were going to be stuck with all this trash and then um little spoiler alert this week that I'm currently living in we missed it again so our trash is disgusting right now and it just needs to be dumped and I'm like it gives me anxiety because I hate having all that trash in our house it's not in our house it's in our garbage but I just want it gone so we're I'm just gonna we're gonna have to put it out the night before which we should have done in the first place but we didn't so now we know um okay moving on to later part of Wednesday I did film a plan with me this day the film plan with me script is from um letters to Apollo and I use a munchkin to mark that I also had the date off this day which kind of sucks because I feel like I always have holidays off and so I never get the holiday pay um so that really sucked but I had the day off and then I did some laundry just so that I was just trying to prepare for everything well before we left so I did a whole bunch of laundry this day the laundry script is from Kinsey's Creations and I used a Fox and Pip girl to mark that and then I made some DIY yard house chicken nachos because those are our favorite and yard house is about 
45 an hour away from our house so we don't go very often and so I decided to make some because my dad did make some enchilada sauce like homemade enchilada sauce and so I used that and oh that's what I used the chicken for too and some cheese and olives jalapenos guacamole sour cream it was so good but I mean it was very filling but it was really really good and then this day, I decided to apply for jobs. Um, I used Annie Modi to mark that. And then I also, this day was the first day I took out my electric blanket because it was pretty cold and I love my electric blanket. And then I also ended the day with playing The Sims. And then Tuesday, I used a computer to mark that I had to schedule my interview. Um, woke up early in the morning to an email to the local school district out here asking to do an interview with me and I was like super excited so that's what I did um honestly I applied just because I feel like I have I mean okay yes I do have a lot of time I should be using my time efficiently with possibly filming videos for you guys but I don't um but I just feel like I could be doing other things during that time and so I'm like okay maybe I can apply for a part-time school job kind of like switch roles with this being my part-time job and Lululemon being my full-time job so that's why I decided to apply and just I don't know just for fun just see what happens and I really miss working with kids it's been six months and it's just I I miss it a lot so that's why I decided to just apply and just see what happens um, so I scheduled my interview that day and then I also did a target pickup run target pickup run I guess you could say that right I did a target run but it was just a pickup order and then I went to Chipotle since I was over there and then I had a bones binge and then I came home and took a quick little nap before work and then also this day was a pretty big Happy Mail day. Um, the Happy Mail script is from SPC and I use a GP girl to mark that. Actually, you know what? I think the Happy Mail script, yeah, sorry. It's not from SPC. It looks like Jessica's handwriting, um, but it is from Magical Sticker Co. again. And then I also um, submitted my doTERRA order this day for like my monthly order. Um, so that doTERRA script is actually a custom from Station Stickers, which I also have a coupon code for. And I use a Fox and Pip Girl to mark that. And then I was just in my feelings this day. Um, there was just a lot going on. So I used a Nope Girl again from Fox and Pip and an in my feelings script from Kinsey's Creations. And then I ended my night with just having like a me day, me night and washing my hair and just kind of doing all that kind of stuff. And we're going to go ahead and move on to Friday. So Friday, I woke up super early because I had my interview. I used the Pumpkin Paper Co. Girl to mark waking up early, and I stick with the Plan Co. Girl to mark my interview. This is actually a therapy sticker, but I didn't have anything to mark like an interview, and so I was like, you know what? I'll just do this instead. So the interview went great. I got offered the job right on the spot, and it is really exciting. I'm super excited. I still have not started yet just because I had just gotten home and I had to do all my fingerprint stuff because I don't have any of that stuff here in Arizona and it takes a bit for it to like get all processed and so I just have to wait for that to be done but I'm really excited and it's like actually like with the school district because um, prior back in California I I worked for like a private company so we were like partnered with the school district but it wasn't actually a school district job but for this one it is with the school district so I'm essentially doing what I was doing at home um, which is like before after school care um, I'm mainly a preschool teacher though in this job position which is not my field <laughs> um, I'm usually school or school age so K through sixth grade um, school I just have to get used to it it's definitely gonna be new for me um, but I'm really excited to get back into what I love doing <laughs> um, so after that I put down a um, emoji or no a munchkin um, saying feeling good because I felt really good that I got offered the job right on the spot and interview went great and I'm just like really excited for it came home had some me time outside um the me time script is from ice cream joe and i used another munchkin to mark that and then down below i used an emoji from the coffee monsters co and a call gabby script there's your script gabby because <laughs> i haven't used that in quite a while but i did call gabby and we had a good conversation and i told her about getting the job she was the first person i told about getting the job and then we just had a good conversation it's like much needed and then um later on on friday i had to actually go 
back to work and so it was a super busy day at work once again and then I made a really yummy sandwich for dinner this day the sando script is a custom from Kinsey's creations and then I didn't get off till 10 p.m. because like I said I am in PST we close at 9 o'clock PST so 10 o'clock my time and I was like, you know what, I just want to clean, get this house cleaned up before we leave. I don't want to have to like be stressing about it the day before we leave. So I decided to just have a cleaning day and we didn't go to bed till like two because we were cleaning and mopping the whole entire house. Um, and then I also did some more laundry this day and I was just in my head, just stress and just other things going on. And so that script is from, um, where is that from? Letters to Apollo. I don't know why I couldn't think of that. Letters to Apollo, and I use a fox and um, cactus girl, kind of like face palming the floor. And then I ended my night with just playing with stickers. I was just organizing. I think I filmed a haul bit too, but I just was playing around with my stickers. And then moving on into Saturday, I started my morning with my morning fuel coffee. Um, it, since I had a pretty late night the day before, and then I had to work early in the morning. The morning fuel script is from um, Station Stickers, and then I also cooked some mac and cheese to say like homemade mac and cheese, not the frozen one from Trader Joe's, which is the best mac and cheese. I made my own, just with things we had in the um, in the fridge I wanted to get rid of. So we had some leftover pasta, we had some cheese, chicken, broccoli. Oh, it was so good. So I made that for lunch and dinner, and then I also did some more laundry this day and packed up. And then I got, um, I think it was my Letters to Apollo order. I got it like on Saturday. So I was like, thank God I got this before we left. Um, the Happy Mail script is also from Letters to Apollo. And I used a Paper Shire sticker to mark me getting all my stickers. And then we ended our night with watching The Blacklist. And then moving on into Sunday, we slept in this day um, just because we wanted to be well rested before leaving. And then I made some brunch. Um, the brunch script is from Kinsey's Creations and I use a munchkin to mark that. And then we also got some gas because obviously we were driving, I don't know how many miles it is. I think it's 800 miles um, from here to our house in California. I think that's what it is. So I think we end up stopping like four times each each time just to like make sure we have everything. But um, yeah, so we ended up getting gas. That is a custom. Actually, I don't think it's a custom anymore from Kinsey's Creations. When I got it the first time it was and I ran out and so I had to do a repurchase. So she does have these in her shop now. And I use a wonton and a million sticker to mark that. And then I use a paper and milk sticker to mark that we drove home and for dinner, we stopped at Chipotle. I stopped at Chipotle. He got Jersey Jersey Mike's, which we love Jersey Mike's, but I was really craving Chipotle. And that Chipotle sticker and Starbucks sticker you'll see here in a moment is from Station Stickers. And then the Chipotle burrito is from Fox and Cactus. And I use a munchkin for the Starbucks. And then I use a sticker to mark that I went to my dad's house. We finally made it. That is actually from Happy Day, which was a gift from Sage. Um, so I was really excited to use it. I first didn't have it in there. And I'm like, oh, I can use those stickers that she gave me. So I put it in there last minute and it looks so cute. And then I also got some more Happy Mail this day um, from Kinsey's Creations. She like shipped those out so fast. I had it to go, I had it ready to ship out to my dad's house because I'm like, okay, I won't be home and it'll probably be there. Um, I'll probably be there by the time it, it finally ships out, but it beat me home. So I was so mad I didn't get to include it in my haul that is up already. So that'll be in the next haul, but it got a good chunk of things. So I'm really excited to show you guys that. And then I ended my day with having some family time with my dad, just catching up and talking about oils because I feel like that's all we ever talk about. Um, but I love like talking about oils, which is weird, but yeah okay so this is what it looks like i hope you guys enjoyed it um let me know down below if, if you guys have any questions about any of the stickers um make sure to subscribe to my channel so you guys can see more videos from me and um follow me on instagram it is erica marie plans thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys next time all right bye guys